morning everybody it's Megan it is Monday and um, I wanted to make a quick video with a few updates um, this weekend I had actually intended to make a more lengthy video about what kinds of activities I did over the weekend and an update video on my weight but um, it was a hard weekend just for things totally unrelated to this and so I did not get to do that, but nevertheless, it was a good, um, eating weekend for the most part. Um, I did go over my calories both days, but very minimally, so nothing that's going to cause me, um, an issue. Also, I want to let you guys know, um, just numbers wise, that, um, my starting weight, ugh, was 342.2, which is insane. My highest weight before this time was 324. That was in 2005, I think. And I had lost a lot of weight. I'm sorry, I'm chewing gum. That's pretty obnoxious now that I think about it. But um, I had lost a lot of weight since that. And that was my highest weight ever. And... Um, I thought I would never see another three in front of my weight, but I have, and I almost, in fact, made it to the 350 mark, which is insane. So, anyway, 342.2 was my starting weight. That sucks to have to say that to you guys, but it is what it is, so that was my, that's my starting point. On Saturday morning, I weighed in. And my weight was 336.6. So, I lost 5.5 pounds last week. So, I was pretty excited about that. Definitely heading in the right direction. I don't know if I'll be able to duplicate that kind of weight loss every week. But, it'll definitely be my goal to do everything I can to make that happen. Um, like I said, this weekend was very stressful. So, um, I did have a lot of moments where I wanted to stress eat. Um, and I did not, for the most part, do that. So, I have to count that as a major victory. I did not completely just fall off the wagon and, um, revisit old habits. I really stuck strong. So, I am proud of myself for that. Um, so this week, let's hope that I can make this happen again. Um, I would like to lose another three pounds this week because I'd like to be within the next two weeks into the 320s because the sooner I get under that 300 mark, the better I will feel, the happier I will feel. So, um, so if my starting weight was 342.2, that means to meet my 50 pound goal before school starts again, I need to be at 292.2. So. That gives me a goal to work toward. And my overall goal, by the way, is 175. Um, that's where I'd like to be eventually. So I am going to keep... So 292.2 is my end of summer goal. And then once I reach that, we'll set another goal. And then I will let you guys follow me um, through that one. So uh, the next goal... <laughs> is going to be challenging because of law school. Um, the fact that it's so time consuming, the fact that it really jacks with my schedule because I also work a full-time job and I'm a mom and all of that stuff. So, um, that will be interesting. And over the summer, I'm going to really need to think not only about being successful with my summertime goal, but also about how I'm going to make this work come fall. Anyway, okay, well, I am I feel like I'm rambling at this point, I promise, but I will make a video with, um, the, with my kids, um, showing you guys kind of what's going on in everyday life and what I'm eating and all of that, um, but this weekend just was not the weekend for that to happen. So, um, I'll keep you guys posted as the week goes on as to how things are going. I hope you guys are all doing well, and um, I will talk to you next time. Bye.